the bulk oil storage and transportation company boss says it lost products worth 194,760 cities in the Bupe Depot truck park fire. Now, four bulk road vehicles, two of which were loaded with petroleum products at the truck park, were damaged. A release from Bost signed by Malika J indicated that one of the trucks contained 36,000 litres of diesel and other uh, uh, the same quantity of petrol. Bost further assured residents the catchment of a constant supply, indicating that product supply to the regions in the north and the general operations of the company will not be affected. The Bupe Depot is the central fuel holding point of Bost, serving the Savannah, Northern, Northeast, Upper East and Upper West regions of Ghana. It received products through river barges via the Volta Lake and through bulk road vehicles, BRVs loaded from Bost, Accra, Plains Depot. Now, the, the exact cause of the fire has not been ascertained as of now, and investigations we understand are underway, and the statements further added. Meanwhile, we understand that the Savannah Regional Fire Command uh, ACFO Kwesi Bafo Ewa has admitted that uh, there were no fire engines in the central Gunja district to fight the fire. He's joining us on the line now. Good to have you, sir. Now, how do you fight fire in the situation you find yourself with no fire engine at all? Uh, thanks for, first of all, thanks for having me. Uh, when the fire... We had a distress call around uh, 19, 19 hours. But by then, our Bope fire tender was down, was out of commission. So that notwithstanding, our men at the scene were dispatched to the incident scene with uh, fire extinguishers. They tried to douse the fire, and uh, the fire got out out of hand, so they reverted to using uh, the fire hydrant at the premises of bus. So they made a foam compound or foam concentrate to douse the fire before the arrival of the Dam and Go Fire engine in okay. two hours time. Mm. Upon arrival, they were able to douse the fire and they prevent the fire from spreading to the bus premises. And also, we commandeered another fire engine from the Tamale with a water tanker. Both of the engines assisted us a lot, so we were able to control the fire at exactly 22, 31 hours and the fire was totally extinguished in 23.09 hours. Okay. So but had it not been our men, the fire could have spread to the bus premises. Mm. But I'm sure if your engine was working, it would have made a difference. How soon are we looking at uh, repairing this engine you say is faulty? At the moment, we made appeal to various stakeholders, and thank God on the 25th, 26th, we had assistance from bots, and uh, they assisted us with a colossal amount. And uh, because of the festive occasion, I uh, we went to Bobo, who was earlier on giving us an estimate, but they were on recess, so they promised Monday, which is coming Monday, they mm. will let the electricians and mechanics come to Bope to assess the situation so that we'll face the tender. Okay. And, uh, well, in the face of all this, you also touched on some challenges you're facing. Briefly, can you tell us what these extra challenges are for you? Uh, very well. Uh, the ch challenges are numerous. One, the water situation. At the moment, uh, Due to the vagaries of the weather, the Hamatan season, we normally draw water from open sources, not rivers. The rivers are drying up, so even the means to get water to fill our fire tanker or fire tender 
It's a challenge now. Oh, great, you read, a great, sir. Appeal. Sir, you raised the to, issue of Hamatan. Are, are you listening to me, sir? Yes. You raised the issue of Hamatan, and interestingly, we are in the season. So how are you going to cope, even though this challenge is existing for you? Uh, at the moment, uh, we have a few dams around. Okay. We, we are using. All right. But our challenge, that pertains to the water aspect of it, I have made appeal to World Vision last, last year. They intend assisting us this year. And also we have appealed to the district assemblies to come to our aid and other donor agencies to also assist us so that we can have boreholes, mechanized ones, in all our fire stations in Savannah. Okay. All right. We are grateful Apart for, for that, your time, sir. We are grateful for your time. Uh, Commander ACFO Kwesi Bafo Ewa there telling us about uh, some of the challenges as well as the updates on the fire. But firemen had to wait for a fire tender from the northern region about an hour's drive to enable them fight the blaze. Now, the incident happened a few meters away from the premises of the bulk oil storage and transportation company. The region is said to have received funds to repair a broken down fire engine, but the company working on it had been on break and so it remained unrepaired. He said uh, the service is ineffective in the region due to several challenges. And I'm sure that you heard some one of the challenges that he mentioned there. Right, so after the incident, that was the regional minister there on your screen who visited the scenes to ascertain uh, the level of damage there at the premises.